first of all, I want to remind you that British Airways first started bringing scheduled flights here just over a year ago, January 2009, at, a, at the start of what has been the most difficult year in travel tourism for decades. And the fact that they have expanded the service to a second weekly flight today is a very important indicator of the confidence that they have in our destination for the future. It is therefore reason for us to feel really good about the possibilities, but it also is a reminder of the responsibility that we have to make sure that the flights bring uh, significant numbers into our country and that we get maximum expenditure per person into the economy through hotels and restaurants and transportation and entertainment and all the other services that relate to making a visitor experience a world-class experience. So ultimately, the best way for us to ensure that this service continues is to help to grow it. And it's the responsibility of all stakeholders, along with the government, to do all we can to grow the demand for our destination, grow demand for our products and services, and subsequently uh, ensure that people keep wanting to come on these flights. It's not just about a lovely uh, 77 aircraft, 777 aircraft landing and some people getting off. It's about making sure that it's good business for the country. Tourism is the business of making people happy, making people uh, relax and get away from their daily stresses. And I think St. Kitts and Nevis is one of the Caribbean destinations that is perfectly suited to achieve that. We can all make that happen on a sustainable basis if we get out there and promote and put packages together and put goods and services together that people want, that people need and are looking for. We're very optimistic that we're going to be able to achieve that on a continuous growth curve. And this flight today, coming in so quickly as a second weekly flight after just over a year, is an indicator that we are making progress. So this is really a very good day for St. Kitts and Nevis tourism. fantastic news for, for the island. I think it's brilliant. So, um, yeah, the, the whole crew know it's the, uh, inaug well, the inaugural second weekly service, yes, yes. and uh, we're telling the passengers that. I think they're delighted to be here after a long flight from the United Good. Kingdom. Good. Have you flown in here before and no, on the other flights? So no, first no, this flight? is my first time here. Uh, I hope to be able to come back on holiday sometime soon. Well, we look forward to that. We, have, we do have a little gift for you. Oh. 